His wife and mother died on Valentine's Day, 1884. Depressed, he left a ranch in the Dakotas. Returning to New York, he entered politics and rose to Assistant Secretary of the Navy. He resigned during the Spanish-American War, organized the first volunteer cavalry, the Rough Riders, and captured Cuba's San Juan Hill. Elected vice president under William McKinley, he became America's youngest president in 1901. This was Theodore Roosevelt, born October 27, 1858. In 1909, Roosevelt warned, the thought of modern industry in the hands of Christian charity is a dream worth dreaming. The thought of industry in the hands of paganism is a nightmare beyond imagining. The choice between the two is upon us. In his book, Fear God and Take Your Own Part, 1916, Theodore Roosevelt wrote, the seventh century Christians of Asia and Africa had trained themselves not to fight, whereas the Muslims were trained to fight. Christianity was saved in Europe solely because the people of Europe fought the Mohammedans who invaded. Theodore Roosevelt continued, the civilization of Europe, America, and Australia exists today only because of the victories of civilized man over the enemies of civilization, that is, to beat back the Muslim invader. Hey everyone, hope you enjoyed the video. To see more like this, be sure to hit the subscribe button below. Get all the latest content from TCT Ministries. We'd love to pray alongside you for God's blessings in your life, so you can email your prayer requests to prayer at tct.tv or click the link below and submit your request at tct.tv. God bless you and thank you for watching.